Hello everyone, and welcome back to Snow Globe Rescue. I'm Tony, and as usual with me is Allie. Hello. So today we have another uh, subscriber request, and uh, I'm going to try to pronounce this properly, but thanks to uh, Pawan Ekanayaka, uh, to, uh, who uh, uh, she saw this in episode 33 and asked us if we'd fix it. So uh, this is a Christmas theme globe, and it uh, it's all bears, like teddy bears. So we've got uh, like a mother bear and a kid in the kitchen there with a little bear on top there. Uh, oh, that's not the kitchen. That's the, uh, I'm sorry. That is, is the fireplace? No, it's a dresser. Oh, it's a dresser? I can't tell. It looks like a dresser there. In, oh. Yeah, I thought it was, <laughs> I thought it was just was a dresser. Well, you know what? From the angle I'm at, and I haven't really taken a close look to it, I, I thought it was like maybe back well, to the fireplace. Yeah, so. yeah. So that that is a dresser, and they got a little teddy bear in the dresser, That's and cute. then two bears. And then, of course, the, uh, the base is... Uh, a bunch of bears dancing around. Uh, there's a, you know, couple of uh, cardinals, uh, snowman. Uh, so uh, a winter scene. Now uh, this snow globe, um, I found at the Weigh and Pay, the uh, the uh, outlet store, and it was in uh, one of the bins with all the other stuff. And uh, someone had just broken this, like just before I got to it, because there was a, there was a puddle of water. And I saw the puddle of water and it was running down the street. <laughs> and I look in and this I saw this sitting in there. And as you can see, it's all smashed. The uh, There's pieces of glass missing. It's all cracked. And uh, this note was inside of it. Uh, I'll take this down so I can cut my fingers. It says, from Jen Snap, Christmas, uh, 2001. So we don't know who it's to, but it was from Jen Snap. We don't know who it was for. 20 but years later. Yeah, so 20 years ago, somebody gave this to somebody. Uh, so the uh, the issue with this is a uh, broken globe. Uh, all the water's missing, all the snow's missing. We, ha good, we have replacement snow. We bought we snow did. online. And we'll leave a uh, link in the uh, de in the description if you want to find the snow. Uh, we'll show you where you can order it. Uh, so we just need to uh, replace this uh, globe right here and uh, put some water in it and think we're good. Yeah. That's really all there is to it. So, all right, let's, let's get to it. it. All right. All right, so in order to repair this globe, we need a new globe. And so it turns out we happen to have this one right here. Uh, this is a globe, a snow globe that I found at the flea market for like $3. And I wasn't sure what we're gonna do with it. Uh, it's kind of a simple globe, but uh, I thought if nothing else, we can use it for parts. And so that's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna yep. go ahead and take this globe apart. We're gonna remove this uh, ornament get the globe off the base, pull everything out of there, and we'll use this globe here to fix this globe. And, uh, you know, if one day we want to fix this globe, all we need to do is just find another globe and we'll fix this. So uh, let's go ahead and take this apart, okay. uh, get this globe off of here, and then we can fix that. Yep. So, go ahead. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm. Okay. We have some wires connected here to the uh, base. Oh, I wonder what it does. That's interesting. Yeah, we never actually, I didn't realize this had bad. Okay, so you know what? We'll uh, we'll figure it out later because we're not going to use this anyways right now. Yeah. Well, you know what? Let's see if we can get that. Uh, yeah, let's see if we can get her out. Yeah, let's see if we can get the stopper out without disconnecting the wires. We'll just keep it all together. Yeah. All right. Okay. So let's go ahead and turn this upside down. Here. We'll just let that that cover hang there. Okay. Okay. Tilt it over this way. Okay. Uh, let's see. I'll right. tilt it over, all right. I know you will. <laughs> all right. Doesn't look too bad, actually. This one might be pretty easy to do. Oh, yeah, it's not giving you any resistance. No. The uh, figurine is out. The cover still oh, connected. Gets to the light post. Yeah, um, it, the battery works this uh, lamp post here. Mm. So uh, 
We might actually use that one day, yeah. but we're gonna set this aside for now. And uh, actually this has snow in it, which we can recover. So we'll go ahead and pour this water out, recover the snow, and then remove the uh, the globe. Yeah, I want it. I want extra snow. Okay, we'll put extra snow in it. All right. Fine. <laughs> okay, we'll be right back. All right. all right, we poured all the water out of here. Uh, we're going to recover that snow here in a, in a few minutes. Uh, the next step is to remove this globe from the base. And what Ali's going to do is Ali's going to heat uh, the base up here, all this glue holding the uh, globe into the base. We're gonna heat that up with a uh, hairdryer and we should be able to just remove the base once it's melted. All right, go ahead. I see it moving. All right. All right. All right, there we go. It took a few minutes, but we got the, uh, the glue heated up and the base released. I think we heated up so much that the, the, the we're gonna, let's see. Uh, okay, so the next thing to do is remove this uh, ornament from the top of the globe. So, Allie, go ahead and shoot some uh, some heat on more. there. Yeah, and then okay. we'll we'll get that ornament off of there. Go ahead. <laughs> All right. All right. And the ornament is off the top. Easy peasy. All right. So, um, <laughs> there we go. Is the uh, there's the base. There's the ornament on top, and we have the figurine over there by the sink. Okay, and uh, put those together. Yeah, put all that together, mm -hmm. and if we ever want to put that globe back together, all we need to do is find another another globe to go on there. And you know, now that I know that light post lamp lights yeah, up. Yeah, now you're, now you're interested in fixing that now, maybe, aren't you? Yeah, maybe. maybe. All right, so uh, first thing we need to do is clean up this globe. It's got a bunch of residue on it. we got to let this... Yeah. Uh, we gotta let this hot glue cool so we can uh, use a razor to take it off. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and take a sponge and a uh, some uh, dish soap and just clean the inside and out of it, uh, get the glue off and we'll be right back. All right, the new globe, or the replacement globe I should say, uh, is all cleaned up now. We let the uh, the glue cool. I actually, uh, after washing the, uh, the globe, put it under some cold water and then we used the uh, razor to get up as much of the glue as we could and around the base and everything. And then uh, goo gone in a rag, got the rest of it off of there. So this is nice and clean now. All right, so now that we have our new globe here, the next step is to remove this globe right here. Mm -hmm. All right, so same procedure. We're gonna have to remove the cover and then heat up the base to get the globe off. So let's go ahead and start. It right, looks like we got some screws holding the cover in. I didn't notice that. Let's see what this is before we start heating it up. Oh. oh, look at that. Yay. Hey. I made it easy. Wow. K-Care. Good job, K-Care. K-C-A-R-E, K-Care. Uh, yeah, no glue. This cover was screwed on. Very nice, Love I like it. it. Like it, all right. Like that like makes things easier. Yeah, All right, so that was that so was easy. Yeah, lost. three screws. Three screws. Instead of three drops of glue, it was three three screws. All right, so now uh, there's no water in here to worry about. So let's just go ahead and get that uh, stopper out of there. Yeah. Definitely pull on that side. Okay. The um, lamp right. was getting close to the globe. There we go. The uh, figurine. And the figurine is in good shape here. The figurine is, yeah. a, is, is attached. It's not coming loose. Okay. And the figurine is also, it's not covered with gunk or any, it's, it looks fairly clean. So yeah. this is a, yeah, this is in good shape. Uh, we just need to rinse this off. Yep. All right. So uh, I'll put we'll, that aside we'll, for now. Yeah, put that aside to rinse that off. And now we need to get this globe out of here. Uh, same way. This one's got Come a, this one has a lot of glue in it. All right. All right. Oh. It's, on the, it's on the back of that. You didn't get any in your eyes, did you? Nope. Okay, okay keep going. All right. Uh, some of the globe came out. Uh, some of it didn't, so we're going to keep heating it up and get the rest of this glass out of this globe. So we got all of the broken globe out of this uh, base right here 
And what we're gonna do now is just clean up some of that excess glue that's in there, and then uh, we'll be almost ready to put this back. All right, we got most of the excess glue out of the base here. There was like two sticks or three sticks of glue's worth in there, so we- This one put some yes, elbow grease into we, it. We chopped it all out of there. Okay, so now okay. we've got our base. We've got our figurine, we have a cover, sorry, and then we have a glow. All right, so we're gonna get rid of all this. Mm -hmm. So the next thing we're gonna do is we are going to get this globe ready here. We're going to, uh, this is what? This is a, this is a six inch globe. So this is gonna take uh, about a half a gallon of water roughly. All right, for the benefit of those who haven't seen our previous videos, um, uh, when it comes to recovering snow from a uh, globe that has dirty water in it, uh, the globe that was that had the smashed uh, globe, obviously, that we're fixing didn't have any snow, but this, the globe that we used for parts did, and we're recovering the snow from there. So what we did is we poured the globe water into this measuring cup, let the uh, snow settle to the bottom, and then we'll just pour this water out and as much as we can without losing any of the snow like right about there and if there's some glitter in there it doesn't matter because we're gonna yeah. we're gonna put new glitter in there anyway so uh i'll fill this up again and i'll probably do this maybe three times four times until i get uh clean snow and then uh, that's what we'll use for the uh, snow globe so we'll be back as soon as this is all cleaned up Let's do it. all right so uh we need water now. So this is, uh, like I said, a six inch globe. It's gonna take about a half a gallon of water when you grab the water. And uh, for those of you who haven't seen this before, this is the uh, filtered water with some, we put about a tablespoon of alcohol in here uh, to uh, control any allergy or bacteria or whatever. So we're gonna go ahead and fill this uh, about three quarters of the way or so. Maybe right about there. Yeah, you see that most of that gallon's gone. Yeah, it uses a lot, yep. the size globe. Okay, so now we have snow. So this is the snow that we recovered from the uh, parts globe. And we're gonna go ahead and use that in this globe here. And let me uh, pour a little bit of that water out and get the rest of that snow in there. Okay, now Allie wants to put extra snow in this globe. I do. So we have snow that we bought online here, and uh, we have a link in the description uh, where you can get this. So we're gonna put this snow in there as well. All right. Perfect. Oh. It's two different size snow. Two different size snow, we'll see how it works out. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, so we got snow from the parts like globe that. and snow that we bought online. Okay. So now, uh, okay, uh, so now normally, uh, if you've seen our previous videos, uh, we put something in the water to thicken the water up so that the snow and glitter fall slower. Uh, we have a link in our uh, uh, description to a video where we show you the different things you can use. Uh, but for us, what works best is clear glue. Mm -hmm. And we use about one tablespoon of clear glue per uh, cup of water. Uh, and uh, this has eight cups, so we'll put eight cups of water. And Ali wants me to put one extra tablespoon, uh, eight cups, uh -huh. of, uh, eight tablespoons of glue in here, plus an extra, so nine tablespoons of glue. Uh -huh. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put nine tablespoons of glue in here, and we'll go just cut to the end because this is gonna take a minute. All right, here we go. Okay, that was approximately nine tablespoons of glue and now we're going to stir that up and uh, as in previous videos when you stir up the glue it will uh, initially be cloudy when you first stir it up and then if you keep stirring it clears up once it's dissolved and uh, there we go okay all right so now go ahead and hold that alley and we will put the figurine in and I'm gonna wet the figurine with uh, the, uh, excuse me, the stopper with some water here so it uh, slides into the globe easier. And no matter how much I scrubbed it, that's uh, about as good as it gets. Yeah, you won't see it anyways. Yeah. But sometimes you just gotta remember when you're cleaning your figurines, it's, you know, the older the figurine, it's 
good as it's going to get. Mm-hmm. Huh. I might actually get this with no air oh, bubble wow. on the first try. Look at that. This doesn't happen very often. Let's see. Well, I have, I'm not done yet. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, we're getting getting a little. She's spitting at you. We have a gusher here. Hold on. She I might. It. Am I gonna do it? Maybe. Maybe. Uh, maybe. Oh. oh. Finishing touch there a little. Right. Oh, uh, so close. So close. Man, we haven't seen it in water before. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah, it's the first time we've seen it with the water in it. Okay. So. Okay. Uh, we got one little air bubble here, and uh, since we got the globe out of the out of the uh, out of the base, we're gonna go ahead and use the submersion method to get that. Make sure we get it out completely. Yeah. Okay, so here we're gonna go set it up. Okay. okay so what we've done here is we have uh, like a spaghetti pot here. This is a big pot that uh, is about a foot and a half tall, uh, filled with water. Uh, not all the way up, but uh, just enough so it doesn't come over the sides. And we put the globe in there. Uh, and what we're gonna do is we're going to grab the uh, stopper here and I'm going to grab it with my uh, needle nose pliers and then we're going to get that bubble right up here to the stopper we're going to put it under the water and get that bubble all the way up there you got it? Mm-hmm. and then we're going to pull the stopper back and just let the bubble come out and there it is okay see if you don't have a syringe, this is one way that you can get the air bubble out without a syringe, and this worked perfectly. No air bubble whatsoever. Okay, so now we can move on to the next step. All right, the globe is all dried up. Um, we got this. So Allie decided, we didn't mark the uh, stopper before taking this apart, but it doesn't really matter uh, yeah. because not, neither doesn't really have a front or yeah. a back that you can really yeah. see. So Allie decided this will be the front right here. Yeah. So we are going to drop the globe right in there like that. Yeah. So that they face. Yeah, exactly. Like that. Yeah. Right, good? Perfect. Yep. Okay. Yeah. All right. So now, now that we've got it in there, we're going to flip this upside down. Okay. All right. All right. Make sure the globe is centered. Okay. All right. And. Okay, this is going to be about a, a two-stick globe, I think. Yes, I, maybe uh, even a three. Maybe even three. Sticks. Okay, we're going to uh, glue the uh, globe back to the uh, uh, base, base here. And we're going to put enough glue, not only to stick the globe to the base, but to go over the junction of the uh, stopper and the glass here, just to seal the whole thing and attach the, the, the globe to the base. Okay. All right. So, like we said, this is probably going to be a two or three stick globe right here. So, let's see. I'm going with three. All right. Here we go. Yeah. All right. It took four sticks of glue to fill in the space between the globe and the base and across the stopper to seal it all up. But... So this is now attached to the base and the globe is sealed. Hold on. We have one air bubble right here. Always pop those air bubbles and put a little extra glue there when that happens. Otherwise you can develop a leaf. Right there. Okay. And well, then we're going to let this cool. Right. And then we'll come back and finish putting everything together. Right. So uh, we'll be back. So that glue is cooled. We're going to go ahead and put this cover back on. And like uh, you saw at the beginning of the video, this cover screws on, it's not glued, so, so nice. very nice, yes. Okay, so let's just let it sit mm -hmm. there for a bit. <laughs> One. All right, all finished, there she is. I really like the effect of the smaller pieces of snow with the larger pieces of snow. Right. The uh, the snow that we recovered from the parts globe uh, had with the pieces of snow are larger than what we bought uh, online. So as you can see, there are like little pieces of snow and then big pieces of snow. Let me shake that up one more time. You can see it. However, uh, it's weird because this is the first time we've seen this with a water. 
Well, not just with water, with with a globe that wasn't smashed. Yeah. Uh, this is the first time we've seen it with that big chunks of glass missing. Uh, yeah, it looks uh, it looks really nice. There's snow. There's a lot of snow in there now. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, this uh, this turned out uh, turned out pretty like nice. It. It's yeah, cute. looks good. And uh, so. Glad we kept this one. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, when I saw it smashed and all the water on the floor, I said, uh, well, you know. At some point, we'll fix it. And so, well, thanks to our subscriber for uh, requesting it. Uh, so, uh, Pawan, I hope you enjoyed the video. And uh, so, uh, your motive it is to get this fixed early because uh, this is yeah. a Christmas. So, uh, this is a Christmas uh, snow globe in, in the summer. So, uh, for me, it could be Christmas all year round. Yeah, I guess for some people, it's Christmas all year round. You're right. So, uh, <laughs> anyways, uh, so guys, if you like these videos, please consider subscribing, liking, and uh, we've got some links coming up to some other videos. And uh, thanks for watching. Thank you so much for your time. We'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.